Hey guys, Joe DeMarco from the Crazy New York Driver Show. Today is Monday night, July the 31st, 2017. And tonight I would like to show you some pictures I took of eBay Open 2017 at the MGM Grand Hotel in Las Vegas, Nevada. So let's get to it, and I'd like to explain a few things as we go along. As most of you know, eBay Open was held on July 25th to the 28th in the MGM in Las Vegas. Approximately 1,800 sellers showed up and we had a really good time. I have taken quite a few snapshots which you're going to see now and I also took quite a few videos of the event. If I have time I will put the videos at the end of this particular video. If not I will put the videos in a separate video of their own. So yeah, please excuse the fact that you see a lot of snapshots of me at the very beginning and a lot of selfies, but I think I'm entitled because it's my channel. But if you went to the event, there is a very good chance you will be in some of these pictures or videos. So keep an eye out for yourself and feel free to comment any experiences you had of this wonderful event in the comment section below. So yeah, what we did is we arrived, I got there a few days early, but the event actually started on a Tuesday. And we went and we got our ID badges, and there was a little confusion at first getting the ID badges, but once we sorted that out, everything was smooth sailing from there. eBay Radio had several live events where they broadcast live, and I was fortunate enough myself to be broadcasting live on one of their events. In addition, I also did approximately a 20-minute video where I was interviewed by Audrey and we discussed many eBay things and we also discussed eBay Open and the positive things that we were taking away from it. The event itself was culminated by a party at the Brooklyn Bowl which we will explore later in this video. Each day we would start off by having breakfast in the Expo Center. After breakfast, we would separate and go to various seminars and groups. And they even had a customer care center set up where we could each go and review our accounts. Each person was given the opportunity to review their particular eBay account with an eBay representative. And I'm happy to say that worked out very well indeed. There were also quite a few vendors like Bubblefast and ShipStation there and they were represented in the Expo Hall as well. I got to meet a lot of you cool people for the first time in my life and it was an awesome event. There were several groups participating including the thrifting board and on I believe it was Wednesday everybody who was a member of the thrifting board wore their yellow shirts to commemorate the event and to show solidarity. We had a lot of guest speakers arrive and they told us about certain facets and aspects of eBay that they felt were worth talking about. In this screenshot right there you can see Griff is giving a presentation on picture taking. And I tried to sit, I tried to sit into as many seminars as I could and learn as much as I could. One thing I do know is called Facebook etiquette and it's polite to photograph your food as you can see right there. One of my friends was sitting next to me when I took this picture and he said, Joe, why are you taking a picture of your food? I said, man, that's Facebook etiquette. So yeah. And we got to listen to Hal Lawton. We got to listen to Brian Burke. Devin Wenig spoke. And a bunch of other famous and high-ranking YouTube members. I'm sorry. <laughs> a lot of famous and high-ranking eBay members spoke. Here is the bus that I spoke of earlier, which was going to take us to the Brooklyn Bowl later in the evening. We did have a band actually in the hotel that we would pass on the way to the event, but I only saw them the first day myself and I don't recall seeing them afterwards. The hotel had a really nice pool and I ventured outside to take a couple of pictures of it. You can notice how the sky is crystal clear and blue something that's only seen on the west coast and rarely ever seen on the east coast. In the evening, this would have been Thursday evening, 
you can see the tour buses are lining up to take us to the Brooklyn Bowl. I decided to snap some pictures of the buses because I'm a car guy and you know I really get into that kind of thing. This is a view looking out of the front window of the bus at the traffic jam in Las Vegas. That's the bus driver's seat and I was very very taken with that console. I wanted to explore it a little more thoroughly. Lewis Stages provided many of the buses for this event. I myself saw approximately 10 buses, give or take. So I'm sure you guys rode on one of these Lewis Stage buses if you were there. I was on bus number one. I got online early. So here we're walking and we're walking under the link which is that big Ferris wheel. We're walking under the link and we're heading toward the Brooklyn Bowl. That is one of the little podules that is part of the link that you can ride up in if you want to spend the money for the ticket. This is walking up to the Brooklyn Bowl which is going to be on your left hand side. Here you can see they have a sign that actually welcomes eBay sellers. You'll get a better view of it right here. Welcome eBay Open Sellers. Yep, that is us. When I went last year you may remember there was a humongous line to get in but because I was on bus number one we walked right in without waiting at all. And as you can see they were checking for ID tags because if you didn't have an ID tag you weren't getting in. And the Brooklyn Bowl had a lot of great entertainment. They had of course the band which was Bare Naked Ladies. We'll get to them in a minute. They had a magician who you're going to see in the next screenshot who amazed us with card tricks and the spinning credit card. They had caricatures. I did not get mine done because the line was too long. They had a group called the Bumbies, a man and a woman who would actually take one look at you and type out what they thought your character was like. But that's basically it for the screenshots. I am now going to segue into the video section and give you a little taste of what it was actually like at the event. I have to use a voiceover in this particular clip because there's music playing in the background and I do not want to get banged for copyright violations by YouTube. This is just a little taste of the casino itself. Nice to meet you in person, and I really appreciate the good work you do on YouTube, and I wish you much success. This is Steve from eBay Portable Wealth. Have a great day. Paul, as I said, I'm over the hill. And of course, you want to swing by there to pick up some eBay branded apparel for, for our best eBay outfit contest during Thursday's live broadcast. And you know we're going to have our tip line. How many of you know what our tip line is?
have to do a voiceover because there was music playing in the background and once again I have to be careful about the copyright strikes on YouTube but anyway this was the beginning in the morning in the grand ballroom the presentation was about to start this was Wednesday and you can see on the left hand side of the next screen all the yellow shirts from the thrifting board people that's where we had lined up for that day to show solidarity and support so yeah let's keep going with this Once again you are treated to my commentary because they have music playing in the background here and I don't want it to get picked up on the video. But yes, as you can see it was a very nice day. I would say it was approximately 90 to 100 degrees, which for Las Vegas is actually very cool and there was no humidity whatsoever. I bet most of you guys didn't even see the pool. <laughs> Thank you. 
got to support the team. That's right. <laughs> Where is she? Yo, You're on the video, both of you guys. <laughs> Say something. Say something for the video. Oh, we're so happy to be here. First time in the United States. It's been an amazing event. And we're fans of Joe. Thank you. Thank you. See you later, Joe. I'll see you at the party. This part of the video was taken in the Brooklyn Bowl at the party on Thursday night. Unfortunately, I have to voice over this track as well because there's music playing in the background. But here, they had a cameraman set up that was taking our pictures. And as you can see, the gentleman there, Stu, was very happy that I was photographing him at this event. But yes, I also got my picture taken by this particular camera crew. And as you can see, everybody was having a very good time, as it should be at every eBay event. This was a new attraction this year. A man and a woman calling themselves the Bumbies. The object is you would get online and when it was your turn they would look at you for about 30 seconds and begin typing out what they call their fair and honest appraisal of you. Mine reads, you look like you've made your peace with the fact that you're going to coast through life being you and doing your thing. And if someone doesn't like it, they can go take a hike. You actually use that phrase, and you've told someone to go take a hike when they were acting like a bozo. People sometimes wish they had your confidence and wonder how you can wake up and feel totally and completely sure of yourself. Of course, no one is totally 100% secure all the time, but you are more confident than most people are capable of. Overall, 9.3. And then, on the back side, they stamp it and they mark it paid and they autograph it as you will see in a couple of seconds on this particular sequence. I thought this was a very innovative and interesting concept added to the Brooklyn Bowl party this year. As I said I did not get my caricature made I literally stood on line for 45 minutes and wasn't anywhere near the front of the line and I had a bailout because the band was coming on stage and I really wanted to see them more than anything else. So yeah, that was that. I did manage to get my picture taken at the far side of the room as I showed you earlier. And I did manage to get some tricks from the magician. He showed us some card tricks and along with the spinning credit card. And there you can see paid in full. So yeah, let's continue on enjoying ourselves with this wonderful video. This is the bowling alley upstairs in the Brooklyn Bowl. I had three different people ask me to bowl with them, and I would like to have, but I really didn't have the time because I was running around shooting the video and also feeding my face with free food and drink. Because that, folks, 
is just what I do. And then the bare naked ladies came on, and here they are. And as you can see, I'm right up in the front row, just like last year. And I really wish I could share the song with you, but I'm not 100% sure that it's YouTube compliant. So I'm going to check into that. And if any of you guys have any ideas on this particular thing, would you please comment in the comment section below whether you think I can actually post these songs on YouTube? Because I would really like to share them with you. They did all their best songs, including It's All Been Done Before. And they were really, really good. And they even talked to us a little bit about selling on eBay. And as a funny sidebar comment, this particular band is out of Canada. And one of my friends who attended the event is also from Canada. So what do you think happened the next day? My friend is on his plane flying back to Canada. He looks to his left in the seats on the other side of the aisle, and who does he see? The bare naked ladies. I could not make this up. Can you believe it? He was on the plane with the bare naked ladies heading back to Canada, and he didn't even realize it until he was maybe three quarters of the way through the trip. So yeah, that's one of those coincidences that I couldn't make up. So basically guys, that's it for this video. A little look at eBay Open 2017. Please comment below, comment your experiences, comment your feelings. If you were there, I'd love to hear about it. If you weren't there, hopefully you'll go next week. If you have any ideas how I can upload these songs to YouTube, and if I can, please tell me about that in the comment section below. And if there's anything that I left out that you want to see, I can do a future video because there's a lot of material that I edited out. A lot of from the meeting rooms, from the meal time, from the hallway, even some stuff from the Brooklyn Bowl I cut out because it came out a little too dark for my liking. So anything, anyway guys, thanks for watching. I'm Crazy New York Driver and you're not. I will see you guys in my regular video this Friday where we'll talk more about the eBay event and I will answer your questions and comments about selling on eBay. Thanks for watching. Remember, I make these videos to help you guys sell on eBay. Go out there, make it a good day, rock on. Remember, it's all been done before. And peace! <laughs> yeah!